Follow your company's safety procedures for working on live gas pipe. Ensure all components are tight and secure. After the appropriate cool-down time of the fittings, pressure test the assembly per company procedures. Tap the PE pipe through the top of the Electrofusion insertion tapping tee using the HV tap tool and raise the cutter. Remove the tapping tool and install the cap on the Electrofusion tapping tee. Install the traceable rod in the end of the stuffing box following the manufacturer's procedures. Always inspect the O-ring before use. Replace any damaged O-rings. Install the stuffing box with the traceable rod to the pup extension assembly. Open the 1 inch valve on the pup extension valve assembly. Soap test the assembly above the valve. Mark the rod with a permanent marking pen at 6, 12 and 18 inches above the stuffing box to enable monitoring during withdrawal of the rod. Push the rod into the tap tee while holding a silicone wipe against the rod to continuously lubricate it. Lack of lubrication can result in excessive push force and possible breakage. Remember that the fiberglass rod is fragile. When pushing the rod, keep hands within one foot of the stuffing box to avoid kinking the rod. Do not attempt to force the rod past obstruction. Set the drag on the reel brake of the rodder so the reel turns slowly while pushing the rod. If the drag is too loose, this can cause the rod to unwind outside the cage. After insertion of the rod into the pipe, use a locating transmitter and receiver to locate the traceable rod now inside the PE gas pipe. Ensure sufficient grounding of the locator equipment for better results. When the tracing is complete, pull the rod back through the tap tee and reinstall it onto the rod spool. Adjust the drag brake to apply light tension on the reel. Manually push the rod into the reel. Do not manually spin the reel to take up the rod. When retracting the rod, the lubricated wipes can be used to help reduce friction when retracting. Wipe the rod while inserting it a few inches into the stuffing box and then retract it again. The grease fitting can also be used while retracting using company approved valve grease. Once fully retracted, close the 1 inch valve. Remove the traceable rod and stuffing box from the pup extension assembly. Install a squeeze tool on the 1 inch PE pipe in order to remove the valve assembly following your company's procedures. Cap the 1 inch PE pipe per your company's procedures.